So I have so many plans for 2020 and I'm just so excited. I think the best thing that has happened for me so far, one of the best things, I'll say one of the best things, because I've had a lot of good things, but one of the best things that has happened for me so far in 2020 is that I've learned to slow down. And when I say that, I mean, I know for me, I'm an excited person. I like to get stuff done. So when I'm handed an opportunity, I like to take advantage of it. And I'm realizing now that I don't have to take advantage of every opportunity and I don't have to help everybody with every opportunity. So the people who get me now are lucky. And the people who have gotten me and didn't appreciate that they had me, you'll determine whether it's a loss or not. I don't have to um, you know, speak on that. So I know what I can do and I always make sure that I can give people the same quality work over and over and over. So. That's definitely one thing I always try my best and I always want to do my best because I would want somebody to do that for me. So moving forward, I definitely know how I plan on executing things. And I'm at the point now where I'm, I'm busy. I really don't, I can't take anything else on. And that's a good thing, you know. So I'm very, very grateful to God that the work I did in 2019 was not in vain. And I wound up being able to utilize the experience that I have to now work on projects and be contracted out in a way where I'm going to definitely become an authority in what I do. And becoming an authority is key because when you become an authority, you have the experience and the knowledge for people to take you seriously. You have the experience and the knowledge to charge what you want to charge for your business. You have the experience and the knowledge to get through those hard times and it will help you better to trust the process and prepare for opportunity and that's really what I'm working on I really want to keep that in the forefront of my brain because there's gonna be hard times because anything worth having is worth fighting for and I'm just going harder and harder to increase what I'm doing and really find that pocket where I know like okay this is exactly what I want to do. And the, a key thing that I'm looking forward to is in the work that I do, I'll be able to bless others by providing them with tools and resources, but also providing them with, with jobs. You know what I mean? Like, that's what people need. Everybody is trying to do their thing right now. I want to be able to help everybody that deserves it, needs it, and they actually want it because they've already put some work in. I want to help those that help themselves always so just wanted to share that with y'all i hope you have a great day and i hope that you are working towards your goals remember you can visit my website www.mommymorebucks.com it's getting updated on a regular i've already made some changes now so if you go on and look some things are different but it's because it's about making sure that i can provide the best value for the people that i deal with Sorry, this dude just cut in front of me. Like, trust me, I'm being very safe. That's why you don't see me look at the camera a lot when I'm driving. I only look when I'm at a stop light like now. But I look because of people like this jerk that just cut in front of me and put on his signal after he started cutting. I digress. I'm sorry. Y'all are my friends in my head. So, you know, y'all are really um, joining these car rides with me on a daily basis. Okay? But anyway, stay focused. Stay believing in yourself. People will believe in you once you believe in yourself. And you got to try something because when you try stuff, even if it doesn't work out, at least you know what doesn't work and you'll be getting closer to what does work. Hope you have a good day.